words have been like. <laughs> exactly. Taking the words out of your mouth has been extremely competitive in that room. Very proud of how they uh, made up their mind to go from point A to point B as fast as they can go. Uh, they're not sitting there evaluating uh, the next step. They're just going. And uh, they're accepting their mistakes as they go. And uh, uh, they're getting better from it. I just love the competition. They know it's a, a competition amongst each other. It's healthy. And... Um, and it's fun to watch a bunch of guys get better at the same time. It really is. It looks like there's a pecking order out there in terms of like who's running the ones and the yeah. next guys. Do you have one sort of in the back of your mind? Well, you know, I'm just uh, based upon the end of the season status. All right, Zeke was the next back in. Uh, you know, then it was Rod. But uh, they they understand that at, at any given point in time um, that that can change. And that's why you get the effort that you get from them every single day. It can change at any split second. Um, but, no, they're just out here competing. They're out here just trying to get better. Uh, to sit there and say who's first team, who's second team, way too premature for that right now. Do you now. see something out of Briante, though? Mm -hmm. Is he – I mean, he had a blitz yeah. pickup today that was pretty good, and yeah. he had that breakaway on that shovel pass. Just talk about what you see from him. Yeah, I'm starting to see uh, Bronte starting to act like he knows what the hell is going on. Excuse my language. <laughs> yeah. You know, um, he's, 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 learned the, he's learned the offense, and he's starting to play fast. And, you know, we're starting to see the things that Bronte – already had within himself, but it's just now coming through his execution. So it's just a matter of him uh, becoming a student of the game, learning the game, and now he's playing it fast. What's it like for a coach? Is it frustrating when you don't see that development? Absolutely. Happen? But that's my job as a coach. If I don't have that diversity as a coach, then, you know, they don't really need a coach. For people <laughs> who say, that, well, you obviously lost a great running back in Carlos Hyde, how yeah. can they possibly replace that production? What do you say? I said it has to be replaced. You know, this is the Ohio State University, and it's the next man up. And I'm sure if you ask uh, Carlos Hyde, he'll tell you the same thing. You know, it's the next man up. So somebody has to step up and fill the shoes of Carlos Hyde. If it takes more than one guy to do that, I promise you it's going to get done. Ezekiel said that he's uh, gained 20 pounds. He's yeah. bigger, stronger. How different is he from last year? Well, I'll tell you what. It's not different. You know, he's still going hard as he can possibly go. The one thing about Bryante, he walked in the door with an Ezekiel. I'm, I'm sorry. The one thing about Ezekiel is that he walked through the door with an incredible work ethic, and that has, you know, sustained. Now it's a matter of him taking his game to the next level, anticipating a little bit quicker, uh, understanding defense a little bit more. So he's still got a ways to go in his development, um, but he's definitely on track. And you said one way or the other the production will be replaced. Do you prefer to have a Carlos type, just one guy do it? I'll tell you what, that's an interesting question. I prefer a guy who's going to be productive, period. I don't care, you know, how it gets done. You know, it's not a matter of me getting a prototypical six-foot, 230. No, it's not that. If it's 5'9", if it's and if it's 200 pounds, and if you're going to do what I'm asking you to do at the level I'm going to ask you to do it, then we're going to, we're going to live with that. Does it have to be... It's different aside from that, just one guy being carrying the load, or do you? Yeah. I'm always going to operate under the notion that I need at least three. Mm -hmm. I need at least three, you know, and it's five of them. <laughs> did Bronte lose a little bit of the hunger that maybe he walked in here because of freshman? 